YouTube friends and family hello Tuesday gonna install some flooring today I'm quite sure I also have to make a trip to the gene pool I've told you what that means right we call the greater Portland area being our biggest population center the gene pool because that's where all the people are I'm gonna go down and check out a new job there that I think I'll be doing later on in December. <sighs> gonna be a full day. Gonna be a kind of a crappy and cold day too. Thanks for coming with me. See you on the road. Oh, I just remembered I have to go to my father's house to pick up a power plane, which is a tool that I'm gonna need pretty much first thing, so glad I just remembered it, golly. bed this morning imagining this job and I decided that I'm gonna add some intermediary sleepers in here to prevent any kind of uh, board wiggle because I don't want these boards squeaking at all so I'm gonna put a little extra support in between these sleepers and then I'm gonna use the power plane to plane it down and taper this to zero there and to zero over here getting to work Yep, I probably got, you know, 
couple of hours of leveling this up. Yeah. I decided to put in a little bit, a few more sleepers just so I, there'd be absolutely no wiggle in the boards. Good. I was actually yeah, a little was, concerned about that too. Yeah, I was laying so this morning. That looks a lot better to me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. Uh, yeah. So I'll just, you know, some just power planning now to sort of taper, taper this. Yep. You know, and um, I'm going to taper down to basically zero here, and then I'm going along the level and just sort of projecting out. And, you know, it's a little bit of a trial and error, and there'll be some, oh yeah, you know, but um, right on, Scott. <laughs> All right. Thanks, man. Yeah. this power plane and this power plane has a very sharp blade and it spins and it takes off you know a very small amount of wood every time so I'm just tapering these little joists here these little sleepers here tapering them to zero down to the shim uh, dimension that I need um, so I, mean, I have a string line and I'm stringing it all the way across to the point I want it to vanish um, and I'm just sequentially taking wood off these sleepers until I've got the level I want. My next step is to put a surround around this fireplace base. Uh, one of you asked, how am I gonna get the flooring underneath the wood stove? I'm not. This tile will stay. I'll put a ring of wood around it and then the flooring will butt up against that. So that's gonna be my next task. I hate to stop my work day at two o'clock, but I have this meeting in Portland for my next prospective job. I gotta get down there. It's a really crappy day out here. And I kinda got a headache too. Anyway, I'm sure I'll just get right through it. Uh, hey, it was a good day today. You know, it doesn't look like I got a lot done, but um, I definitely did a lot of the technical stuff today. So, you know, um, leveling out that floor, Figuring out my layout, how the boards are going to go, that's all time consuming stuff. Tomorrow, the glory, the laying of the floor. Let's go to Portland. I told you.
job and I'm working with that guy you just saw Paul he is gonna be a lot of fun to work with I can tell um, we've worked on and off not directly together but um, on the same projects when I had a crew you know he basically uh, my crew worked on his daughter's house and um, that's how I got to meet Paul great guy he is also an energy auditor or he was he has a very similar background to, to me and um, yeah, it's just gonna be a lot of fun to work with him. And this house that we're working on was the result of an energy audit that I did, the, the, the work essentially. Um, and Paul recommended me for the energy audit. And it was an energy audit that was on one of my vlogs. Um, I, I forget which one, I should be better at that, but I'm not. So anyway, it's good. Um, again, not looking forward to the drive, but whatever. You know, you drive to, to, to get work. Out of Portland now. safe I'm sure which is good I'm sure but it led to a longer trip I think I'm, I'm like three minutes from home I got a headache I'm hungry I'm thirsty I'm dirty I'm ready for this day to ease on into a recliner have I ever introduced you to my recliner it's where I do most of my work um, maybe I'll show you tonight if I don't, hey, thanks for coming with me on my day. I had a really great day, you know? Most of them are. And guess what? I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>